Hello everybody, this is uh, Code Warp coming here to uh, offer you a guide on how to do the account merge so as you can remove any extra XRP accounts from your ZUM wallet and we're going to do that today uh, using ZUM so before you proceed with the account merge here you do want to go through and make sure to remove the CSC or any other trust lines on the account there otherwise it will cause complications with the account merge and or account delete tool there so what we'll go through and do here is you're going to tap on the token and you're going to remove here and it's going to give you a warning saying that you're removing this token from the XRP ledger account are you sure you wish to do that Yes, I am sure. So now it'll ask you to put in the password for the account here, and we are going to put in our super secret password of not password one. And just to confirm here, alrighty. And so while that transacts here, we'll see it'll come up in a moment. And there we go. The token has been successfully removed from our account which you'll notice my balance went up by 5 XRP. That is the 5 XRP that is held for the uh, trust line reserve there. We're gonna go down to the dump tray here. Okay, and then we're gonna click view more accepts. And once that's loaded up here, you're gonna see here a little pink icon that says account merge. We'll go ahead and tap that one there. And now, this is letting us know that the merge, which also works as a delete on the XRP ledger, will move the funds from one of your other accounts to another account. So what you'll need is the account that you want to delete that has no obligations or no other ledger objects. So if you have any trust lines added, you do want to make sure to go through and remove those trust lines first. Okay. So if you have that, please go ahead and do so now. Okay, so the next thing you want is the destination account that you're going to be sending it to. So what we're going to do here now is just go ahead and say, I'm ready, let's continue. So step one, we're going to select the account on which you wish to delete. So we're going to select the account that we want. So I created a couple here. So I'm going to go through and delete the hodler account here at the top. Okay. Now we're going to slide this over and it's going to ask for the password that we set up or if it's an older wallet before ZUM 2.0 it's going to ask you for a pin code. This one requires a password which for this example it was set up using our super secret ultra safe password of not password one. Okay. So once that's recorded we'll go ahead and sign the request and here we see that it's been signed successfully. So step two is we're gonna set the destination account. So for this example, we're gonna use the code ward one address here. And then again, we're gonna slide the request over and this is going to ask for our a pin code here. And this will be the pin code or passcode to the destination account that you wish to receive the funds to. So we'll go ahead and hit close. And the next step is we need to sign the account delete transaction. This is going to delete the account and reset it on the XRP ledger there, which removes the private key. So we'll go ahead and hit next and we're gonna review the transaction. And so we're signing it with the hodler account. We're sending everything to the main account and it does cost 5 XRP for this transaction. So if you have 20 in the wallet, you will receive 15 XRP back. Myself, I have 25 and some change in there because of the CSC trust line that I added before. So note at the bottom here that when you're deleting your XRP account and sending the remaining balance to an exchange, make sure the destination exchange supports deposits using account delete transactions not all exchanges do. So I would recommend actually doing this to an existing wallet unless you're trying to get out of XRP basically. So at this point here, we'll go through and slide to accept. We are gonna get a danger warning 
and this is saying that this is an account delete transaction. When signing your account, the account will be deleted and all the remaining funds, except for five reserved XRP, which is a fee from the XRP ledger for deleting the account. This will be sent to the configured destination, i.e. our main account. I'm using code ward. So please check the destination twice and only continue if you actually want to delete your account on the XRP ledger. I have verified that here. So we're going to go ahead and hit continue. And again, we're going to put in our super secret passcode that we set up for the hodler account, which is not password one. And we'll just double check. Yep, that's right. So we'll go ahead and sign that transaction request. So it'll verify, send over the XRP ledger, and usually within about four seconds, it will be submitted successfully. There we go. So at this point, our funds have been migrated and the account has been successfully deleted. So if we go ahead and hit close, we'll notice that our main account has gone up by the 20 XRP. Again, the reason mine went up by the 20 is because I had 20 in reserve for the XRP wallet and I had an additional five in change for the CSC trust line and a little extra balance there. So we see here now that the account has been deleted, the funds have been moved, and we have merged that account over. So this here is how you would go through and merge an XRP account on Zum. If you have any questions, you can feel free to reach out to me on Discord via casinocoin.chat, or I am also available on Twitter via at codeboard1. All right, thank you very much.